Your blades should be cleaned and oiled every day, especially when they do not cut or about ready to be resharpened. First, you will need to slide the blades apart halfway, as shown here, and brush them in a downward motion. Then slide the blade the other way and brush again. Next, put the blade on a clipper, and with the motor running, lower them into the blade wash just until you see that the liquid can get in between the blades. Hold the blade there for about six seconds. While keeping the clipper pointed downward, remove it from the blade wash and gently shake. Wipe off any of the excess liquid with a paper towel. Next, place a drop of oil on both rails, on each side of the blade. Then, run the clipper pointed downwards for about six seconds and turn off. Remove any excess oil with a paper towel. To keep your blades performing properly, oil both rails on each side of the blade each time you put it on the clipper. After oiling, run the clipper five or six seconds, turn off, and wipe off any excess oil. Most clipper work should be done before the bath. However, if you need to oil your blades after the bath, just start clipping under the chest or inside a thigh. This way, if you have any oil residue, it will not be noticeable. The first way to cool a blade is by oiling. Oil the two rails located on both sides of the blade. Run the clipper for five or six seconds, and then wipe off any excess oil. The second way to cool a blade is by spraying with Andis Cool Care Plus. Spray the blade for three to four seconds. You only need to spray the back of the blade because it is the only surface that will touch the animal. The third way to cool a blade is to dip the blade in blade wash for five or six seconds with the clipper running. Then remove the clipper, turn it off, and while holding in a downward direction, gently shake off the blade wash. Finish by wiping off the remaining liquid from the blade. And the fourth way is to change from a hot blade to a cool blade. Stop the clipper, push in the blade release latch, and remove the hot blade. Next, replace with a cool blade. Turn the clipper on and snap the blade down into cutting position. Now you're ready to resume clipping.